What's up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Um, I just want to thank you guys uh, for the support on the last video. Uh, the quick day in the life that I made, uh, like I think right. a week and a half ago. I didn't expect it to do so well. Um, I really expected only like five people to watch it. But I, like, I'm closing in on like 400 views and I think like around 10 likes. That's 10 more than I thought I'd ever get on a video like that. So, um, I'm just gonna make a quick video today. I thought about it, like a lot of people were like, why didn't you show organizing that mess that you had in the last video? If you guys didn't see it, I'm gonna like post it or here or at the end of the video so you guys can check it out if you didn't. Um, basically just organizing, how do you organize something like that? Because a lot of people, they don't do a good job organizing and then they're like, oh, that's, if I can't get to the back of my van, that's too, that's too much, that's too crazy. It's, it's not that big of a deal. I mean, it's, it's a big deal to some people, but you can easily um, organize throughout the day. Clearly, you can't organize something that with that many oversized. It's not that easy. Um, you kind of just have to organize as you go. But I'm going to show you what I do. I haven't checked my stops yet. I'm going to check it in a little bit just to show you guys what I got today. Um, I'm, it could be anything. It could be the same as last week or um, completely nothing. Um, with my with the way I work, it's either you have a lot or a little bit. That's that's my that's my usually day to day. So we're gonna check right now and see see how much I got. Okay guys, so I'm just about to hit submit report. Hey okay guys, that we're gonna we're about to see how much stops I have. And if it's low, then I'm gonna try to do my best to update you guys throughout the day and show you guys how I organize it. But if it's a lot, then you guys know it's gonna be just like last video where I can't really do that much updates. So I'm just gonna go ahead and hit continue. I'm just gonna hide my DSP. 281. Now, 281 is not bad. For me, it's not bad. That's normal. If I can get under 300, that's a, that's a good day. So, oh, but never mind. It's, it is 178. Stop. 178. Um, I'm gonna take a look at the route real quick. Uh, this seems like a good route. This seems like a good route. I know this route. Um, let me just see where we're ending. This seems pretty good. I could probably update you guys around. Yep, this is a good route. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try to do my best to update you guys and show you guys what I had from after I pick everything up to um, how I go throughout the day organizing as I go a lot of people say don't organize as you go just a waste of time no just organize as you go bring everything closer to the front as you as you progress through the day um, organize oversized so the labels are facing up it just helps you move quicker throughout the day you'll you you'll see it like if you'll move more efficiently that way but here I'll, I'm gonna go into load up now and I'll show you guys how it's done Again, like last video, uh, how I load up, and then um, I'll cut to the first stop where I do try to do some organizing, and then we'll just go from there. All right, see ya.
So we're at our first stop of the day and it is 10.40 at the moment. Uh, I showed a little glimpse of, uh, of me leaving the station. It was around like, I think 10.13. 10 13 at the time when I left so it took me a good uh, I think 27 minutes to get here to my first stop which isn't that bad usually it's I mean usually it's less less time but today was a little bit of traffic so I'm gonna show you guys what I'm dealing with here uh, as I loaded the van uh, when I left this is how it looks okay we got currently four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen fifteen totes here and I think about 30 oversized maybe 25 to 30 oversized here so I'm gonna cut to um, organizing this a little better I don't like leaving like that because it starts shifting around and if I need oversized I can just grab it one off the shelf here I usually leave the top shelves um, just for oversized nothing no totes go on there it would be annoying to have to reach all the way up here to grab a tote so I'll update I'll cut to when I um, organize everything on the top shelf so this is how I usually like to do my van everything on the top everything on the top nothing on the bottom unless it's like really big and heavy then I keep it there if you run out of space keep it like this second row let me go pan out for you guys with the wide angle lens boom there you go everything on the top just like that totes side to side not I see a lot of people um, having the front touching the back on the ground and that's taking up a lot of space. That's wrong. I don't like doing that. Keep it like this most of the time and you can fit a lot in here. All right, side to side. This is what my van looked like on the day of last week when I did upload that quick day in a life. This is what it looked like. Of course, I had the large ones over here on the floor. But yeah, this is basically what I like to keep it. I'm going to go ahead and do a couple of stops, maybe around like 50 or 40 and I'll update you guys soon see ya okay guys I said I was gonna update you in about 30 stops well it's um right now I'm at 92 let me flip so you guys can see better so you guys can see 92 I was getting in the flow of it early on so I didn't want to stop and just like ruin the flow so I just kept going all right so this is about halfway um, I threw some totes around on the ground just so you show you guys that like what a real-life scenario would be if you guys are finished with a tote Usually everyone just leaves it on the ground and uh, a couple gaps here and there You see finished off some totes on the top here and I'm just gonna organize it real quick and I'm just gonna give you guys one more quick look with a wide-angle view Okay, so gap here because it's missing finished off I don't know if you guys remember that it reached all the way to the end and that side too a couple boxes here I'm gonna try to fit everything on the top shelf now now that we have the room I'm gonna slide everything down still have four totes down here I'm gonna try to put them up here just so they're eye level and I don't have to look down at the numbers all right I'm gonna update you guys in just a quick minute all right and just like that guys everything is all organized again I can see all the labels nothing in the back other than the other than the empty totes, nothing under there. So uh, we got seven totes left, uh, 91 stops. All the oversized on top, nothing on the bottom anymore. I like to keep everything, like I said, eye level, just so I can see. Instead of having to duck down, everything is eye level, even the oversized eye level. All right, so everything is good. And I'll update you guys in the next couple minutes or a couple seconds for you guys a couple hours for me all right and if you real quick the time is 2 55 almost three o'clock all right i'll update you guys later i'll see you peace
guys? What happened here? It was just full a second ago. And the time is almost seven o'clock. How did that happen? All right, so, uh, looks like I'm done, but not really. I have like one more package left, which is right there sitting. But yeah, that's how I organize everything. I'm gonna catch up with you guys after I get the green light to head back, all right? See you guys in a minute. All right guys, so we just got the green light to head back. Um, it is seven o'clock on the dot. Uh, pretty good day, pretty boring to say the least. I like it when I have more um, packages because like it lets you visit more houses, you know. It just gives you more of a challenge. I like the challenge, but today was like a basic day. It was like an average day. Um, 281 packages and 108, 78 stops in the morning. And then let's see what we finished with now. I'm just gonna show you guys what I finished with because sometimes it could say 278 in the morning and then at the afternoon when you're done, it's a little more. And I was, it's 194. Uh, um, so if you guys like go to if you guys remember from the start of the video I showed it it was like um, it was like one it was 178 or 175 one of those I can't remember but now we ended off at 194 stops and if you guys don't know the reason for that um, why you get more stops at the end is because those group stops that um, you could be going to sometimes split that means if like you have to walk a little farther if you have to walk a little farther to get to the other um, group stop, like if you go to one house and then you have to drive a little or walk a little more to get to the other house, that's part of that stop. It will separate and count as its own stop. So that's why um, I got 194 now. But yeah, uh, it's gonna take me about 20 minutes to get eyes to see right here. I'm just gonna show 20 minutes. Ahead. Um, if I don't update you guys when I get back, to the station in my car or anything then uh if you guys did watch up to this point i appreciate you thank you guys so much for watching up to this point i really hope you enjoyed um i just want to reach out to a community because i know there's like people out there they want to feel a sense like there's a community out there for the drivers that actually like doing their job you know i actually like this job um in the in the when my first 30 stops i I like I like um, you know moving a lot. Like some people like the the physical part of it. Some people don't. Me, I like it. That's why I bought this like fitness tracker here, so I could see how much exactly how many steps I took. And just to check, I took I took you guys sixteen thousand six hundred steps today. So yeah, um, let's let's scroll down and then we can see eight miles, 736 calories. You see, that's why I like this job because it's very active, it keeps you active. Um, a lot of people, they use it, they like this job because you can, you know, you can shed some weight in a couple a couple weeks. Me, I like it because I stay, it helps me stay fit. If I didn't have a job like this, I think I'd, I'd gain weight. I'd be like, I'd be like over 210 pounds if I stayed. Um, with a job that just didn't require me to move as much. So, like I said, if you guys did enjoy up to this part, please hit the subscribe button, hit like. I'm thinking about doing these um, uh, top top fives, where it's like top five um, houses um, Amazon drivers hate, or stuff like that. You know, if you guys have any recommendations, please drop them down. I always take recommendations. All right, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace. Hey guys. It is the next day. Yesterday was the ninth, where you guys saw me um, organize it earlier in the video, and today is the next day, the tenth, Saturday. I just wanted to show you guys what my normal route looks like. If you guys think, oh, 281 is is a lot, this is what I normally get right here. Uh, 355 and 193. Yep. That's what my normal day looks like. And I uh, guess I got what I wanted, more packages, right? Boom, and just like that, guys, it is Sunday. Yesterday, or a couple seconds ago, you may have seen me show you guys 355 packages with 190 something stops. It's now Sunday, that was Saturday. Now it's Sunday, and um, let me show you what 
I got now. It's similar to what I had in the beginning of the video when I did the, I showed you how's, how I organized. So now we're down to 272 and 183 packages. I just wanted to show you guys like what's the day to day like instead of just showing you one day and then um, you know just one day. This is like day to day basis you know wake up what's the next day going to be like what's the next day going to be like. So you've seen my three day process I only work three days a week so that's how it is for me and I'm pretty sure it's going to it's always it's always like that so thanks guys for watching I'll catch you guys later peace.